Alright, hello everyone. Now look, remember the other day it proved from 1 goes to 3, they're equivalent. So 1 is equal to 3. But 1 is not equal to 2. So you get a, you get a twist. See the twist? Yeah. Right. Uh, but then I went through this and I said 2 and see that was going around the same circle 720 degrees twice around the same circle you get back to the beginning and I thought oh that proves that 2 is equal to 0 but it doesn't all it proves I think is that you can do 2 you can do 720 degrees so which is interesting here's the proof that 2 I think that this is the 2 there's 2 2 is equal to 0 what you do is you take your 2 and you deform it like this Okay. And now I've got, if you follow the rotations around, so that is rotating, well, taking you through a series of rotations that rotate from 0 to 360 degrees going anti clockwise. And then it turns it around and goes 0 to 320, 360 degrees, but in going clockwise. So they cancel one another out. So that's 0. 2 equals 0 because you start out with a 2 and you end up with them cancelling out and you get 0. So there's the 2 equals 0 proof. That's not the Dirac um, belt trick quite either. Ta-da!